It's been a little while, but I've got plenty more inventory on the way. Um, this is LJ from Toro Auto Brokers bringing you a circular walk around and virtual condition report of this 2014 Ford Police Interceptor Utility. Um, finished in black, nice and glossy. Um, this one has 129,000 miles and I'm telling you, it is in great shape for the mileage. Uh, oil change has already been done. Headlights are crystal clear. Uh, just an overall very nice unit. Of course, I always start with the driver's fender first pointing out any defects I might find. Uh, I don't see much on this driver's fender. It looks amazing. I would dare to say there are no defects there. Um, driver's side front door, nice and straight, as you can see. Small scuff here. I mean, and the smallest of the small. Back out about six feet, and everything looks great. This just looks like um, a little wax residue or something that should come right off um, driver's side rear door also very straight as you can see there by the reflection it looks nice and smooth I do not see almost nothing on this door um, rear quarter same thing very nice even the obliques are in excellent condition. Uh, bottom of the bumper. I'm drawing blanks. I don't see anything. Um, back out about six feet and you'll see that it's in great shape just as I said. Um, rear tailgate. Looks like they removed the um, police interceptor logo, but it does did leave some scuffing there. Bottom of the bumper towards the edge does have the typical scratches from taking items in and out. Um, the rear tailgate itself is in great shape. Small scratch here. Nothing out the ordinary. Um, around the hole, looks like it was touched up. Um, a lot of the times around this key hole, um, they have the tendency for the paint to come off. In the later interceptors, they move the keyhole to up there um, to alleviate that. Towards the edge of the bumper, I see a little bit of a scratch here and a little up there. And that's really about it. Um, Applique looks phenomenal, nice and glossy. Passenger side rear quarter. The tiny of the, of the tiny here, there's a little thing there. Super small, but it is there. Um, and another one around there. But there's just little waves. They're not significant dents, but they're small waves. Um, the rest of the quarter looks great. Back out about six feet. Overall, super nice. Um, passenger side rear door. I did notice a ding there. And another one right there. And if I miss anything, I apologize. It's, it's not exactly the easiest when I walk around as you analyze and sometimes the sun gets in your eyes. Um, I don't see anything else on this rear door. That might be a little wave here, but that's all I can see. Um, passenger side front door has a couple small waves there. They're very light things. And the rest of the door, I don't see anything else. Just a small one here. Overall, you can see the vehicle looks beautiful. Um, front fender. Very thin hairline scratch there. Super hard to notice. As you can see, the body's super glossy. Headlights, super clear. Uh, front bumper, very light road rash. I mean, for 129,000 miles, this is well below average. Small little knot there, but I'm telling you, this is well below average for the mileage. Little scratch here, back out about six feet. And I'm about eight feet away now, I apologize. And a lot of those details are not noticeable at all. At all. It's just little light bug damage. Even the grill itself is in great shape. Tiny little nicks, but overall, very nice. Hood, beautiful hood. Hood is beautiful. And of course, even this driver's side headlight, nice and clear. Very light um, wear. 
for having the mileage. This vehicle is well above average. Let's go inside. Let's turn down the volume. Very small split on the seat here. Rest of the seat looks very good. Even the top of the steering wheel doesn't show any abnormal wear. It does have a center console, which is a bonus, of course. Controls are there. AC nice and cold. Oil change has already been done. Miles are 129, 165. Door panel does have some splitting here. But overall, very nice. Rear, rear area looks like it has not been used. I don't see anything significant there. It does have rear door panels. Let's close the door. Opening the cargo area. This one has a nice um, reinforced plywood um, panel here. So if you do decide to use this unit for anything like that, it's it's super secure. And it has a little carpet on top. And it's cut really well too. It even matches um, the factory um, trim piece down there. The factory overlay cover. So it's, it's well cut. This side, same thing. Nice and clean. Also has the door panel. This door panel looks phenomenal. Seat, passenger seat, excellent. This one even has the original window sticker. Wow, 33,000. And uh, books and manuals. Going to pop the hood. Train in the background, I can hear it from here. 3.7, idling very nice. There is a train in the background that you can hear. I'm not going to really harp on the front tires because I have already ordered two front tires. Um, rear tires have about 50% on the rears. That one's low. Um, give me about let's say two weeks maybe a week if you're interested i will order a set of tires for this unit um just let me know in advance if you're a far away customer so i can have that done um any questions you know feel free to call or text this is lj from toro auto brokers